Colin, you're the co-anchor. Colin, you'll be acting out scenes from a soap opera. <laughs> Doing sports is Wayne. Wayne, you're a middle-aged woman who's proud of her body. And Ryan, you're gonna do the weather. Ryan, you're uh, Tarzan, sensing that your woman is in danger. <laughs> so uh, whenever you hear the music, Denny, go ahead and start the show. Hello and welcome to the six o'clock evening news. I'm your anchor, Ling Ling, and I feel most comfortable in a leafy environment. <laughs> Our top story tonight, automakers have found that people who believe in reincarnation are less likely to wear a seatbelt. <laughs> and now, for more news, over to my co-anchor, Rusty Nail. Rusty. How can you be so calm, Lin Lin? <laughs> While you're carrying my baby. I'm not even sure if it is my baby. It could be my brother Rogers, the aerobics instructor with a difference. <laughs> my God, doesn't it matter that I have a rare tropical disease? <laughs> that I'm slowly... Where am I? Thank you very much, Rusty. And now on to sports with our sports guy, Rusty Bumper. Rusty, over to you. Hello. Hello! In sports today, the Rams are doing it, and doing it well, as LL would say. The important thing about these guys is they're in shape, just like me. Who would have thunk? Fifteen kids and damn, look at that! That's what I'm talking about! Thank you, Rusty. This just in. I feel that much worse about my big old flabby butt. <laughs> Over to the weather with Rusty Can. Rusty. Mm. Rain come weekend. Make thing wet. <laughs> Monday sun come out. Make thing warm. Dry out. <laughs> Jane, trouble. Jane. Jane. Take Jane! <laughs> oh. 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 Me got Jane. Oh, no Jane. <laughs> Ugly man. Thank you, Rusty. And that's all the time we have for the 6 o'clock news. Join us later at 11 and good night. <laughs> I'm going to give 100 points each to the people sitting behind me because they look so perky. <laughs> Colin, you only have a five-second memory. Just like in real life. <laughs> Doing sports is Ian Gomez. Ian, you're going to be Ricky Ricardo at his wit's end. <laughs> Ryan, you're the Wicked Witch from The Wizard of Oz. <laughs> so uh, whenever you hear the music, go ahead and start. Hello and welcome to the 6 o'clock news. I'm Chester Flatbottom. <laughs> After a three and a half month medical survey, experts have proven that Al Gore is actually alive. <laughs> and now with the stock reports, please welcome Laszlo Turkey Baster. Laszlo. Thank you, Chester. Stocks are up, 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 up. Thank you, Chester. Stocks are up, up, up. Thank you, Laszlo. I will move quickly on to sports. And now in sports, we had a wild day. Damien Hardpank. <laughs> Thank you very much. Uh, we have a live feed from the hockey game that happened today. Let's take a look. There's Sandstrom going down the ice over the blue. That's not Sandstrom. Lucy! Lucy, what are you doing there? I told her she can't go to that game today. Lucy, where's Freddie Nichols? I got him, Lucy!
And now let's look at what's in store for the weekend weather. Please welcome chlorophyll lettuce crisper. Chlorophyll? Yeah. You've come to see the weather, have you? It should be sunny all weekend. A good time to take your dog for a walk, your little dog. That's all the time we have for the 6 o'clock news. Please tune in for the 6.05 news in just one minute. Good night. Greg, you're the uh, co-anchor. You're a crazed James Bond villain. <laughs> uh, Wayne, you're doing the sports. Uh, Wayne, you spot your girlfriend with another man in the audience. And Ryan, you're doing the weather, and you're a psycho with a chainsaw. No, no. So just pretend it's the weekend. Whenever you hear the music, go ahead and start. Welcome to the 6 o'clock news. Our top story, wives live longer than husbands because they're not married to women. <laughs> and please join me in welcoming our newest co-anchor. Welcome. Thank you so much. Well, Mr. Bond, I suppose you think this is it. Perhaps you'd like to make love to my mistress before I fondue the world! <laughs> Minky doesn't like the anchor, do you, Minky? <laughs> you make her very upset. Perhaps you'd like to drop into my pool of piranhas. <laughs> oh, that one never works. Well, I see by the clock <laughs> on the wall, it is now time for sports with Crash Ripley. Crash! Hi, thank you very much. Well, it appears that in the uh, second month of the lockdown, uh, that, uh, that, that, the, that the NBA, nothing... <laughs> is that... What the hell you do... <laughs> Excuse me! Excuse me a second, right? I'm over here doing my job as weatherman, well, right? And all of a sudden, now you want to go ahead and step in? What's... I got hair, girl! Really? What the hell are you doing? I don't understand! Really? All I mean, every day I come to work, and I pull down the screen, and I put the football team, and I come and I whip my fingers to the bone, and you there with the ball, man! Yeah, with the ball, man! She's with the ball! She's with the ball, man! She's with the ball! Yeah. <laughs> this just in, cheating girlfriends live longer than their boyfriends. And now over to the weather. What's happening this weekend? <laughs> We're expecting a lot of rain in the state of Oregon, so let's just get rid of Oregon. <laughs> ah. Hey, just a bit, man. Calm down. It's just a bit. <laughs> man. Usually I give points to the performers, but this time, a thousand points to the ball guy. Good for you. Let's tell why, man, a thousand points for the ball guy sitting next to you. <laughs>